I can see your point with that one, not gonna lie. Oh yeah, we did bring a little girl down with this. You're wrong, I'm doing this to help Mr. Maya. Girls, calm down and hang in there. I'll buy you a juice later on, alright? Hey! Let's look around, but... So, shit, dinner, that's lovely. There's a short. There's some somewhere I'm looking. I'll just skip up a and have to call the happy one. Hmm. Is there another weapon? I don't think I don't care so much. Oh, that's a shit. Tea Mmm! What's with the global story on T bone sticks? Seagulls? Wait, hold on. Hello. You draw on just 23 and it costs money an intelligent one who seems to have it all together. Oh my god. Francesca Bangarma. Okay, um. Taking care of their um, arrangements for this press conference, right? Yes, that's right. Huh? Is that? But Mr. Han said he didn't know about it. Is that what he said? Actually, I didn't know all the details either. It was a request from the publicity department. All I did was help out and do what I, I was asked. I wonder what about that. I want to. I want to take her to be the type of person to do something without knowing the details. Huh. Uh, 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 I don't know why, um, yeah, no more. I has become, Mr. uh, he has become Mr. Anagal's manager. He's a pleasure to manage with his nice, uh, disposition. Mr. Anagal does seem to like a rather weak-willed man, always doing as he's told. He's always saying, my manager, right, Mr. Nick? Huh. How about you? Do you know the victim, Mr. Cordia? Yes, I know him. Uh, the world is such a small place after all. Do you know about his rightly with uh, Nicholas and I? Honestly, they all like children when it comes to that. Time and time again, those two complete, completely with each other over the most trivial things. If either one of us was an... A, that wasn't so stubborn, and then maybe no one would have needed to die. I've got a hunch I've got this one who knows more than she's on. Uh, she must know why Junior Cordier was killed. <laughs> Do you know any idea as to as to why Mr. Cordier was murdered? Why would you ask me about such a thing? I'm just doing my job, so so do you have any ideas? Yeah, she she may know. Mm. Miss Andrews, sorry, but there's nothing more I have to add to this conversation. It's a psychic like Mr. Knight, yes. There's going to be more and more of these lately. <sighs> more if I be quickly talk to... Oh, Mr. Rye, why are you here? How are you? Mr. Powers, have you been there the entire time? Yeah, people con connected to the Mara uh, are allowed to go home, let alone leave. Oh, I feel bad now. Can you tell me a bit more about the Nicholas Samurai TV show? Okay. 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 <laughs> 
Let's say something from the any wall, something that's a uh, love why and uh wait. A love why. Love why. The girl, Sayo works at a tea shop and all three guys fall for her at the same time. I guess Shiba is like the three brothers. Um, I'm just scared about all this. Only because it sounds like an unusual situation like Romeo and Juliet times three. Yeah. Yes, perhaps what happens next? I want to <laughs> Sayo, does Nisaya fall in love? She does, doesn't he? She. Every Sunday at 8 a.m. I'm going to stop watching Kiss and Masterpiece Theatres starting this week. I can't believe she's really considering that. I'm sorry. I'll skip it. So what's the Jimmy Nature TV show was like? So... I'm just skipping all this because I don't know if it's an important part of the story, but I'm... I'm just... Wait a minute. Huh? What? It was a really lousy ninja job, so I couldn't do any of it. So what's the point of coming a ninja? What boy can you say? Oh my god. We'll be able to say, what about the Princess Miss Olya? Every Sunday at 8 I actually rather the first one. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Which show will I watch? I can't believe she's really considering that. Not too bad. Ooh, hey, that's Miss Andrew. She's Matt's manager. Actually, I was interested in her for a little bit, just a little. So, Mr. Bell likes the type of that, that, this type of woman. But do you know about Miss Andrews? Oh, well, see, there's this thing. I don't really know her, know her, you know? Just sort of a small rumor going around about her right now. A rumor? Ah, if you're into I'll be glad to share about it. He's so happy, he looks like a lion that's just about his next meal. So? Talk about Miss Andrews. Will you mind telling me about this gossip? Oh, so you are interested in it. I figured you would be. Such a witness for celebrity gossip. Really? You too, huh? <gasps> Looks like Italia and Miss Olbex will read. Alright, let's see here, Jiminy Midnight. To the mysterious, yeah, beautiful manager, to the stars, Miss AA. You, you know, don't you? Huh? What? Stop pretending to be in the dark, Mr. Right? Jim and Korea didn't have a manager on his own. Which means if we're talking about a certain manager with an intentional AA, oh, Adrian Andrews. Adrian Andrews. Yes, exactly. This big, uh, this big of news. Which means we'll care about that woman, Ms. Andrews, together with the biggest rival of our clients. But this wonderful thing can only happen between two people. And Mr. Powers looks so happy. Girls just following along, not having any ideas as to why he's smiling. Well, I like saying so no one barging to it as a nice treasure. Ooh, thank you. I want to read it. I want to read it. Jimmy and Manai, okay, Super Saiyan and Ultra Hot Mega Sigra. Love scandal, reliable source that the Jimmy crowd has been gathering because of the mysteries yet people match to the stars, Miss AA. Huh. Uh, how about we just present different things? Uh, yeah, the cause of the press conference, that's I win, fix the press. Yes, the inspiration side everything else, and also was lucky in this match. <laughs> and my nose. Oh, yeah, but the kidnapper. It was that bellboy, and this is the smartest thing. Oh, oh man, huh? Oh, yeah. The guitar case. I kept seeing it. Okay, three by nine says because the bright red guitar. Huh. Oh yeah, you wanna know about the juice? And... 
Okay, um. Um, percent, percent, percent. The soft sound, so sure. Because now I'm wrong, doesn't it? I don't care about people else in the mad thing, can't do it, I'm done. He's having it around the same time as mine, so we know. Really? So I was small, first it was singing contests, then spinning competitions, huh. then it was bowling tournaments, and then it was who th uh, throw the best. New Year's parties. What is going on with those two? Well, so I began to worry. To be honest, June's story ended up so too soon. Oh. Hmm. I want to. Oh no. Damn, no! No. Add insult to injuries, old bad. Hmm. How about if we um, ship it on to... <gasps> oh yeah! The... Oh, the mascot is at the back. Oh my god, the mascot. And he does not claim a serious Scruffy detective is in here. Great, now you can pros calling him Scruffy. Thanks, Francesca. They said something about an investigation briefing earlier, right? Why don't we have to come back to our gallery? Well, we're okay, I guess we can do it, right, Miss Nick? Uh, God. Ah, it's gone. <gasps> oh! Ah, the light, too! So, what did you find out? Uh, well, I'm still in the middle of an investigation. I see. Well, I've already told you everything. I know, dude. <laughs> Um, do you say a uh, costume you are the titan of the brand you're running around, baby? Hmm. Oh yeah, yeah, you already said all this. What about if we um, show... Aha! That's my manager, do you mean her? Yeah. What do you think? Strong woman, right? And she takes good care of me. You're such a mammoth boy. <laughs> Damn. I'm a nurse. Um, what do you think about the article? Huh? If you're talking about her thing of uh, playing with Julia, I always thought she was a bit careless in the way she handled it. And that's it. That's it. Oh no, he did not say kick lock. I was pushing on the PA. Okay, move, move on to the hotel. Chat 4. What about if we. We'll try our luck. We'll try our luck. Guarantee we may don't have anything. We'll try our luck, but. What you witness? Alright, I'm being on for now, then please tell us what you saw. Oh, 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 it's something what? I am a little devil after all. Alright, I'll give you what you want. Nah, nah. We'll go to Lots of Hearts, since she has the less, the least of psychic blocks. We'll move on to. Um, we'll move on to the hallway, where she is. We will try our luck. We'll try our luck. Just two, so. Big scoop. I think she was talk we'll be talking about the article. Hello, will you. Uh, uh, please answer my questions. On the night of the murder, why were you alluring uh, around the victim's room? I told you, then I put my scoop. Why I want to know about the. for the detail of the scoop. That's not something I can tell you. I mean, that's the, my bright bar. Alright, then, and a pleasant tablet photograph, a photograph of looking for a scoop. I'm going to ask you what to get into a scandal. Aha! We love Paul, we're looking for a break with a huge story. Perhaps an unfolded scandal between Junior and this person? Will you be Andrews, right? And this person? Will be Andrews? 
this woman. She's a Adrianager's man and God's manager. The Night Girl Samurai uh, Carl secretly meeting with his rival, the Jim Ninja. It will be the hottest star of the season, won't it? You're pretty good at this guy saying things, Mr. Lawyer. But yeah, I can't just make up the any old thing and think you're all like, okay. You got a backup. Backup? Yeah, yeah. You got that. That was it. Uh, in his ass? You mean new source? That's right, that's it. She shows some of that shows that We gotcha! We gotcha, we gotcha. This is the article from the Southern Weekly Tabloid. Give an angel minute, okay. Eh? This courtier didn't have a manager on his own. That's more his travel, okay. This is Andrew, she has the intention of AA. South is not going to thought to take picture of your proof. That's why you're looking around, lurking around Mr. Cordius door last night. Hello? Oh, we got you. We got you. We got you. We got you. Big scoop. You were looking into Mr. Cordia and Miss Andrew's affairs, weren't you? You got it. I was going to get myself a scoop by uh, catching out in a secret meeting. But there's already an article about on the on the weekly tablet magazines. It's no longer breaking news. But you just say her initial are a a kind of virtual things is that there's ain't no proof of something people are gonna want to see real proof. But at least I do, so that's why I was doing it first. Oh, I'm gonna whip out the reader uh, interest with some gossip and a little misleading. Then uh, spice it up with a little and have my some excellent explicit story. Nice journalistic uh, interjury you got that. I already finished our uh, waiting out my sp my spicy article, you know. The uh, the paper I really on my nose to myself is gone. You know it's to yourself. It was inside the case of my oh the the done off oh. Came here for my big story, then come here to have a treasure disappear on me. Yeah, it's done. It's enough to make it oh god bonkers, I tell you. Okay, uh, are we British here? What's with what's people now now wait? I know I thought I see the big I know I thought I see the day when someone um down steal something from me. You really want the note back, huh? I've got no idea what the story of the dough is. Probably a false face lie. And then. Um... Hmm. Hmm. Wow. Why well, would if we say what's up to Adriana Andrews? What's up with her? And then we snip. Hey? Really? What about you? Really? Um. Okay, I think I got a plan. I think I got a plan of action. What about if I try to find the picture? I right, then and see old bags. I wonder. Oh, it's kind of cute. Just don't know, why is the stuffed animal here? That's the blue banjer. It was my it was my idea. I made it. Mascot, you know. Oh. 
again in the sun in Damasco over every place to uh, station and it's the last thing I do. and gum shoe will hmm. I don't know myself to be honest with Okay. Uh lock shop or A Well what else would gal lose? I'm going right for your secular and do all the shenanigans. I could be wrong. That the Joanne's autograph. Yes, it is. And that is even says my dearest Wendy on it. And that's me, right? Huh? My name is Wendy Obak, so that Wendy has to be me, right? Well, it may be, say, Wendy. Well, somehow I don't think Junior has this Wendy is mine when he met brother. Oh, please give it to me. Let me have it, please. I can't let you have it, just like that. Yes, yes, I know. Then how about an ex exchange? Oh! Whoa, she must really want this autograph. My offer isn't good enough for you. Fine, Mr. Ray, you win. When you back, ready to open up her heart. All of my dear experience. Oh, that was in the heart? Oh, gotcha. I feel bad for you now. Huh? I tell you, I saw him that night. I saw him coming out of a Juni uh, Junian's room. You're kidding. Oh no. It was about 10 minutes before Junian's body was discovered. It was just a coincidence. I was on my way to the toilet and minding my own business. And do you find that guy in the place? Well, of course, I thought I could get a gift certificate or two out of it, and maybe more. Gift certificate? And I've been uh, recreated, uh, re recreated again for that part of the child, you know, the child's mom. This time, you're going to get it. I'm going to. I'm going to work hard to get your client brought to guilty. No, but Mr. Angor hasn't done anything bad. I don't care about these things like that. I know he did my dear poor Junior in. I just do the yellow bell chicken. Yellow bell chicken. I wonder what that would be like. I trust my senses. I know when someone did something bad and I say he did it. What did Mr. Angor ever do to her to deserve this? What did Annika do to you to make you so? You don't know. That guy, he framed my Julian. He created that scandal that pledged poor Julian. Mr. Nick, what is it? What's the scandal? Uh, I'll tell you about it after we, we get back home, okay? Poor Julian led astray by the wilds of the vile chin trust. Chin trust, but Mr. Nick, what the vile and uh, wild temperatures mean? Uh, um, how about we just listen to what Miss Obax has to say for now, okay, girls? So, Miss Obax, who is this woman you're talking about? Adrian Andrews, of course. Who else? Um, that guy, he showed the girl uh, onto Julia on purpose when his own manager bought a wife. I thought lawyers were smart. It was a crazy scandal to make Julia lose face. And uh, that girl drove Julia into a scandal that dragged his reputation through the map mug. Sounds like a crazy scandal. Standard definition of it kind of to me, but do you have any about any? What do you know about that anyway, Miss uh, Obags? I'm one of uh, Julia's biggest fans. I'm always out there gathering information. There's nothing I don't know. And uh, do you have any proof that Miss Dragon did what you say he did? Next weekend's issue of his son Max he says so. Huh? Of course, a tabloid. Next week? Doesn't that mean it's something people don't know about yet? Why would Miss Oba have information like this? That, where did she get it? <laughs> Tee hee hee. 
Open if we detect the gum shoe and said they had an investigation breaching. Yeah. Oh, he's back. Hey, so you can't bow with the blind beater. Ah, uh, because there's nothing to be friendly or happy about. What do you mean by that? Well, things look pretty this time. Look perfect this time around. They have the letters my are alright. Papa, we can't roll over and die. We have to stay positive. Keep it positive. So what do you mean by the evidence is alright, alright? As I, ugh. I can't give you all the details, part, but there's two pi uh, big pieces. Two? And both of them in this photo. The first is the bomb that was missing from the victim's chest. Oh, now I can see it now. Uh huh? That's the one that you found during your um, body search of Mr. Annika. Yep, I found it in the post of the Nickel Samurai special pants. And the second one is the knife on his chest, pal. The fingerprints on the knife and his chest to be exact. Fingerprints? Whose are they? You didn't even have to ask me, well, Missy, it's obviously Matt and God. Tomorrow's trial. Talk about being stuck between a rock and a hard place. Airsight. Okay. So what about this airsight testimony? It's the old security layer, Miss Olbags. I thought so. What do you mean? You thought so? Did she tell you something about? Oh well. I even thought not to open the mouth of hers and blab to anyone. Her blood knob, a knob is stuck on ten. There's no turning down, trust me. Well, then Miss Allback, sorry, all oh, pal. She said Miss Janica came out of the victim's remain around the estimate time of death. No way. Huh. Uh, there's pretty interesting about gas for ourselves. Scandal with a much corvier, but why? Well, two years ago, the woman. Oh, Commit suicide? That was a flash. Suicide? Her name is Celeste Impact. And she was. Uh, Julie Cordiasis' manager? Oh, the victim's manager? That was just a flash. And um, there's no all of uh, Miss Impact's was Miss Andrews' uh, Adrian Justice Mentor. She told Miss, uh, Miss Andrews everything she knew about the business from the square one. A mentor, a woman who was both Mr. Cordia's mentor and Miss Andrews' mentor. Could she? Can I say that I have something to do with this case? Oh, do you have no any more about her pal? So that's impact. She was the victim's mentor and also Miss Adrian Andrews' uh, mentor. It's been two years since her since I know those two two are linked again by another death, or maybe it's just a coincidence. Oh. Why? I'm getting sick of dealing with those one foolish, uh, foolish idea out there and all that. This one karma. You can't seem to stop allying yourself with an enemy, can you? I don't need to treat any of your mates. You don't. You don't mean. I do. Scruffy. You have 30 minutes to get out of here. You are no longer needed. Goodbye. Wait. Please wait, sir. If I don't get the. Quiet. If I weren't full of trainers like you. I wouldn't what? I would've won. Is that what you want to say? Who? That voice. <gasps> Yo, he's back. Edgeworth. It's been so long, right? Ever since the first game. Episode 5, was it? Uh, Rise from the Ashes? This place. Th uh, this person, I mean. Not place. This place is grand. This person. This is... M Mr. Edgeworth. How do you know this is Edgeworth? But you haven't been here since the first game. What am I going to? What am I going to do with you? Still battling other than things go wrong? <gasps> is that new sprite? I see. Actually, that looks kind of cool. You haven't changed your bed, Miss Francesca. You. How dare you show your face to me without a shred of shame upon it? He spoiled the front car my name, dragged it through the mud. You even ran away with your tail between your legs like the ill-bred dog you are. Are you talking about the Von Karma family greed? Uh, greed, not greed, I mean. Yeah, greed, to be perfect in every way. Let's hear it, Francesca. How are 
things going. I hear you are having a rough time maintaining perfection in this country. You. You seem to be getting crushed under the wheel at all. That's why I came back. Keep your applications to yourself. I haven't given given in yet. I won't lose. This case is mine. I'll never hand it over to you. Never. Mr. Phoenix right? I will I'll see you tomorrow in court. I'll be in a clinical last that's on the meaning of total victory. <laughs> so the same wild mare she always was. Yo! It's been a messy. We're 25? If I remember correctly, we were like... We were... Th yeah, we're the, roughly around the same age as... We're 25? Damn! So that's... In parentheses, was... Uh, was Angie's mentor and Korea's manager killed herself two years ago. Okay. Miles Edgeworth, age 25. Ah, oh, it's been a while. Oh, I love them. A gifted prosecutor, he disappeared suddenly a year ago. Stop. I thought you, the prosecutor Miles Edgeworth had gone and died. Mr. Mr. Nick? I, I never wanted to see you again. I think that's enough of a warm welcome for someone you haven't seen in a year. Are you going to run tomorrow's trial? You heard her, right? That's why Mayor haven't gone in yet, it seems. So no, I don't think I'll be making an appearance. You'd be cool if you did. You'd be really cool. Your hatred for me is quite unhealthy, not to mention on one side it. But I will say one thing. You can't wait on your own at the tra tra trial tomorrow. What is that supposed to mean? I have something in definitive that you lack. And working together is the definition of teamwork. It's the power of finding the truth. The truth? In order to understand this case, you have to understand a certain truth. Well, if you ever feel the need to your assistant, is you available to you? I'm not, I'm not in charge of this case, so I am not a bit more generous with the information. Just why it's going to happen. What's going on inside this head? A lot of things may have happened, however, Manfred von Karma was still in my mentor, and a perfect win record is proof of a von Karma one year ago. You could not establish guilt in a few cases, and those who lose is the reason you suddenly disappeared from the prosecutor's office. Do you think because you have lost your perfect win record? To think your motivation for prosecuting Charles was so selfish. It's been better for Edward if you were uh, never come back from the dead, Edward. I see. Then let me ask you something. Why do you stand in the courtroom? What is your reason? Well, with Francesca, she almost always says, I want to beat you this time. The instant she says it me. The courtroom is my personal battlefield for prosecutors and lawyers. I stand in the courtroom.